Today you're going to look at a new um, Air Force plaque that I haven't carved before. This is on black walnut. I'm trying to improve my dust collection so you can actually see more of it as it individually carves. So that's why you see the uh, vacuum attachment hanging there. It gets more of the dust away so you don't have mountains of uh, dust so you can see it a little bit better. Uh, I'm going to keep working on that so it gets better and better. I'm trying to redesign it dust collection system so it sucks all that stuff up yet allows you to see it as it's carving because I use my CNC for training quite often. So this is the Air Force symbol that's not exactly the US Air Force symbol because that's trademarked by our federal government so you can't copy the exact symbol without the written permission. So this is uh, one that's pretty close to it. It's the older Air Force symbol but it, it does the job. I'm making this for uh, Williston Crossings. They have a memorial for veterans, veterans memorial. And uh, so I'm making the five branches so that it'll go with that display. But it's, it's kind of fun. Um, I got these from a design, Vetrix design site, design and make site. So when I'm all done, we'll have all five symbols and it's doing a pretty good job. Uh, it's on, like I said, on black walnut, so I'm carving it at 100 millimeters per minute feed rate and a 50 millimeter plunge rate, and it's a one millimeter bit, and it's just about wore out. Um, I'll be changing it on the next model, but thanks for watching. Have a great day.